now that Google Classroom and Meet features have been upgraded, you'll see a pop-up appear in your classroom. Teachers and co-teachers are always meeting hosts now in your Google Meets. Participants outside of your class can ask to be admitted by the host. Co-teachers are always meeting hosts as long as you start the meeting inside Google Classroom. Something new is that students will be sent to a waiting room until a teacher or co-teacher is present in the meeting. So no longer will your students be able to get into the Google Meet before a teacher is in from the class. So you're going to notice on the Classroom Stream page that the Meet link is now located on the left-hand side. You're also going to see that it says, I have an outdated link. So I'm going to upgrade my Meet link and I'm going to check this box so that it will update all my outdated links on all of my Google Classrooms. So I'm going to click Upgrade Links, or I could select Don't Upgrade Now. So I'm going to upgrade my links. And now that my link is updated, you'll see I no longer have the notification that I have an outdated link. At the bottom of the Meet link, you'll notice that it says visible to students. I can quickly change that right here by going to the three dots selecting manage and then I can toggle on or off the visibility to students. So now the meeting link is no longer visible to students. So now I could join the link right now or if I want to make a copy of the link, I can go to the three dots and click copy the link. When I want to make it visible again for my students, I just go to the three dots, go to manage, hit the toggle switch and click done. Now I can join this meeting right here by clicking the join button. So now I'm ready to join my meet, but first, I'm going to show you what it's like on the student side. Once a student has entered the classroom, they can click the join button for the classroom meeting. Now, as a student, when I attempt to join, I will not be able to join until a teacher is in the meeting. So now I'm waiting for the host to allow me to join this meeting. Now I will join the meeting as a teacher. As soon as the teacher joins the meeting, students who are waiting will be permitted to join. When I go to end the meeting, I can click leave the call and I can quickly end the call for everyone Leaving the quick access button turned off, no one will be able to re-enter the meeting. I'm not just going to leave the call, I'm going to end the meeting. Now my call has been ended for everyone. These new classroom meet updates will make it much more user-friendly for you as a teacher in your Google Classroom.